podcasting session of Advantage Masterminds. I am Ridhula and today we are going to study about matter and its components. Before that, let me introduce my very amazing team. They have worked really hard along with me to make this video truly informative and fun-filled so that you can understand this chapter very easily. For that reason, please do not forget to share, like and subscribe. Also, another very big advantage about this channel is that even you can participate. So, if you want to participate in our channel, or you want to share information, please write to us at advantagemasterminds at gmail.com. So, please do not forget to share, like and subscribe. Today, we have Mohammed Muzamil. Muzamil is not only very academically inclined, but he is also very good in chemistry. He is truly admirable. And you'll get to know more about him as you watch this video. So, it's over to Mastermind Muzamil. Hi, well let me tell you that it is the quality of observing things minutely and enjoying what I do has made me a genius today. Or So let's dive into the topic straight in. We all know that everything around us is either natural or man-made. Like hawa, pani, samundar, earth, moon, stars, Whereas the clothes we wear, ye ghar, phone, telephone, phone, smartphone, car, cycle, and computer, sabhi man made cheese hai. Chai koi cheese natural ho, ye man made ho. On the kush to cheese common hai. Kya hai wo common cheese hai? What are those common things? Well, they are number one. They have mass on me dravyaman hota hai. Second, they occupy space and can be perceived by our senses is called matter. Well, as we all know, not all types of matter are the same. This wooden block, pani ke jaisa nahi. Or, but ye balloon se aa rahi hai, abhi ye in dono se alag hai. Sun is very different from the above mentioned things. What is dry ice? Is it also some state of matter? From the above examples, we can divide matter into solids liquids and gas though there are other two states plasma and both ice and condensed state which are found at high temp extreme temperatures but we are only going to study solids liquids and gas things displayed over here they are for example this wooden plank a marker a plate a cube sugar, a bowl of rice, a sponge, a water bottle. Now all these things have number one, a definite shape. Uh, for example, this sponge as you can see is, is, a, is a cuboid. Then this Rubik's cube is, is a cube. And now this plate it is circular. Number two, they have a definite volume. What is volume? Well, volume is the 3D space occupied by an object. Here, this water bottle is 1000 ml, which means 1 liter equals 1000 ml. I have, a I have a sponge. Are these solids compressible? Let's try this wooden plank. No, not compressible. Now about this Rubik's Cube. Still not compressible. Now let me try this cuboid. Wow! It is compressible. Now what about this eraser now? Wow! For these two things show the properties of a solid, they still are compressible. Do you know why these two things are compressible? Well, if you not, tell us in the comments below. Okay, moving on. We saw that solids retain their shape unless and until an external agent such as pressure or heat acts upon them. Speaking of shapes, do these sugar crystals also have a shape? Here I have some cheese. This is water. 
oil this is juice this is tea and this is milk क्या कोई मुझे बता सकता है कि इन सभी चीज़ों में क्या कॉमन है यस ये सभी चीज़ें कंटेनर्स में हैं ऑल दीज आर केप्ट इन कंटेनर्स वाटर इज केप्ट इन दिस क्लास मिल्क इज केप्ट इन दिस कॉनिकल फ्लास्क ऑयल एंड जूस आर केप्ट इन बॉटल्स एंड दिस टी इज केप्ट इन अ इन अ कप सो वॉट इज दिस शो This shows that liquids do not have a definite shape. Liquids का कोई definite shape नहीं होता है. They take the shape of the container in which they are kept in. Now what about their volume? Here in this glass I have a hundred ml, a hundred ml water. And now I am going to transfer this into this conical flask. As you can see, I have मैंने इसे पहले ही calibrate कर रखा है. देखिए. जैसा कि आप देख सकते हैं इसका इस इस फ्लास्क इसमें भी पानी का वॉल्यूम 100 एम है सो वॉट स्टो फ्रॉम द अब थिंग्स वी कैन कंक्लूड दैट लिक्विड्स डू नॉट हैव अ डेफिनेट शेप बट दे हैव अ डेफिनेट वॉल्यूम आई हैव अ बलून इट्स क्वाइट बिग एंड राउंड एंड नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू स्क्वीज इट As you can see, I can easily squeeze it. And now I'm going to divide it into smaller parts. See, it's a nice snowman shape. Well, it happens. From the so from the above things, we can say that gases do not have a fixed shape. They do not have a fixed volume. They can. They are highly compressible. Coming back to matter, matter can, can is a pure substances or it is a combination of two or more pure substances. Pure substances have physical and chemical properties. They are made up of elements or compounds. Or we can say that matter is a pure substances and can be either elements or compounds. Let's examine elements and compounds closely. Element. It is the simplest form of matter. There are over a hundred and eighteen elements. Do you know all of them? Well, I know all of them, and I can tell you right away. As I say, as I see the elements, you can check the pair table behind. They are hydrogen, helium, lithium, beryllium, boron, carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, fluorine, neon, sodium, magnesium, aluminum, silicon, phosphorus, sulfur, chlorine, argon. पोटेशियम कैल्शियम स्कैंडियम टाइटेनियम वनेडियम क्रोमियम मैंगनीज आयरन कोबाल्ट निकल कॉपर जिंक गैलियम जोमेनियम आर्सनिक सेलेनियम ब्रोमाइन क्रिप्टोन रोबीडियम स्ट्रांशियम यूट्रियम जिकोनियम नायोबियम मलबडमम टेक्नीशियम रोसिनियम रोडियम फलेडियम सिल्वर कैडमियम इंडियम टिन एंटीमनी टिलेरियम आयोडाइन जीनॉन सीजियम बेरियम लैंथनम सीरियम प्रसिडियम नियोडिमियम प्रोमेथियम समेरियम यूरोपियम गर्लिनियम टर्बियम रिस्पोसियम हॉलियम अर्बियम थूलियम इट्रिबियम न्यूट्रिसियम हैफनियम टैंटलम थंगस्टिन थंगस्टिन रिहीनियम ऑस्मियम इरीडियम प्लैटनम गोल्ड मर्क्यूरी थैलियम लेड बिस्मथ पोलोनियम एसिटीन रेडॉन फ्रांसियम रेडियम एक्टेनियम थॉरियम प्रोटेक्टेनियम यूरेनियम नेप्टूनियम प्लूटोनियम अमोडिसियम क्यूरियम बर्कीलियम कैलिफोर्नियम आइंसिनियम फोमियम मेडिलियम नोबेलियम नॉलिसियम द फोडियम डबनियम सिबोरियम बोरियम हाजियम बेटनारियम डमशनियम रोंजियम कोपनीसियम निहोनियम फ्लोरोवियम मॉस्कोवियम लेवमोरियम टेनेसियम एंड गैनस हु दैट वाज क्वाइट माउथफुल here yeah, i also have a few things i would like to share but not now coming to the next point elements ca cannot be separated by physical or chemical means elements are made up of tiny particles called atoms atoms of an element are alike they combine to form bigger molecules called bigger particles called molecules as we know that atoms of an element cannot exist freely in nature while molecules of an element can For example, a hydrogen molecule is made up of two atoms of hydrogen. So the formula is H two. A sulfur is made up of eight atoms, and so on. Some elements can exist how as atoms. However, they are called monatomic molecules. They are they are xenon, krypton, neon, and helium. Now we move on to compounds. 
compounds are also pure substances made uh, made up of the combination of two or more elements or compounds for example water the the formula is H2O, two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. I'm going to explain a few uh, of the compounds like methane. And another example we can give is about hi hydrogen peroxide which is H2O2. That indicates that two atoms of hydrogen plus two atoms of oxygen results in hydrogen peroxide. And another third example, sul sulfuric acid. The formula is H2SO4. The properties uh, and the composition of element of compounds are different from its constituent elements. Water again is made up of two gases, which are hydrogen and oxygen. Composition and the properties of the compound stay throughout the throughout the compound, like if it's water then it is a liquid it's tasteless colorless and so on though we have come to the end of this chapter we are not but we are not finished with with the states of matter but why matter exists in this three set what energy it possesses what forces keep it together and so on do not this don't forget to subscribe and remember you can also be a, a member of our channel just write to us at advantage mark masterminds at gmail.com thanks for watching hope you like my presentation hit the bell icon i hope you enjoy it bye bye